I pushed the rows apart with my hands and two fingers inch deep in the soil pulled over the length of each mound, a place for the seeds I'd plant too close together. I dragged you from the house before work with mud on my clothes and showed you how the corn grew, how the carrots grew, how the tomatoes and the lettuce grew. I showed you in the garden how the rosemary made my hands smell, holding them up to your face and touching your lips with my thumb. I told you how the worms got into the spinach, leaving translucent carcasses trembling on the stem, how the fennel never had a chance, how we should have started it inside, and how the pumpkins were volunteering all over. I went to the garden like I wanted to go to you, my head in my hands and my lips trembling, whispering to the basil as I put my fists into the ground, how we always thought and nothing was simple, how you never made love to me anymore like you used to, spontaneously in front of the bathroom mirror, your panties around your ankles and half your makeup on. I told all of them there on my knees in the dirt how much I missed the ways we used to touch each other in the kitchen, our friends in the other rooms laughing, my hands around your waist while we made dinner for everyone. I saw you once. It was beautiful in the garden, stooping over the basil plants, your arms bare in the warmth of the last of the sun, clipping herbs to give to our neighbors. I stood where you couldn't see me, watching your mouth hoping to see you whispering like I did everything you wanted to tell me in the garden. I let the weeds later spread over and choke the corn full of earwigs and worms. The lettuce without shade and not enough water went to shoot. The carrots clumped like mutant hordes, stunted and tangled with no room to reach into the earth. I froze a bag of tomatoes before in a frenzy I tore weed and vegetable indiscriminate from the ground letting only the herbs remain to brave the autumn. We stood where the pumpkins used to be, looking over the nakedness together. I wanted to say to you in the silence that this was your garden, that my hands moved the earth for you, that everything here was for you, that I was sorry I let it die, that I had killed it, that every plant that lay in ruin, I wanted to touch your lips, that I wanted to make something for you to taste, something to bring you back to me. But you spoke first and put your arms around me in the twilight. We'll do better next year. Pulling me back toward the house, away from the wasted garden. And I went to you like I'd wanted to for weeks. And we let ourselves fall back inside each other, the words hanging on our lips. We will be, we'll do better next year. That now I know for certain. There's some